Well, Janet Grogan joins me now. Thought you were going again. We heard that. We heard that. We did. And you. What is so? What is it like being up there? It must be absolutely hideous. Awful. Yeah, it's really awful. awful. Yeah, yeah. really you're just horrible. just constantly like your heart is gone, your adrenaline. You're like, I'm gonna go any second. And because I had been there before. Yes. I was like, why am I putting myself through this again? He said I wouldn't go back, but yeah. then he sent out that tweet and I was like, oh, maybe I'll give him a second Yeah, because he actually sent a tweet out saying I made a mistake. Yeah. I, should have, I should have kept that, Janet. That doesn't happen so, every day. No, it does <laughs> not. So I guess you, you held on to that and yeah. thought, yeah, I'll give that another yeah. go. What was it like coming back? I mean, did you feel that I've been here so it was easier or what do you think? Yeah, I thought it would be easier mm. and then it wasn't. Yeah, I'm amazed that I didn't get through to the final, his song, but sure we know Eurovision is so political, don't yeah. we? we? We know all of that, but what did he, did he give you advice about going back into X Factor? Yeah, he just said to be myself and like we spent a lot of time together over sure. in Stockholm and he said if you show people what we see then they'll love you so yeah, that's... Of course, that's the that main thing. No, that is yeah. absolutely... Well, he knows. Yeah. He has been there, he knows. Yeah. What about the family? They must be so... I know they're very proud of you anyway yeah. and two years ago we're very proud of how you got through, your mum and all, yeah. everyone else. Yeah. They are your biggest fans. They're always so there backing you. All always. The they never ever said, go get a real job. Like, they sure. always backed me, always believed that I could do this as a career. So. Yes, this is your dream, this is what yeah. you want to do and absolutely. you are good at it. You Thank really you. are. You look amazing. Thank you. You look... And and it's like in the past two years, from seeing you from two years ago, it's like you've blossomed. You've got, yeah. you have, Nikki's right, you have got more confidence. Yeah. I think and that's so, important, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, I think I just came to the epiphany that I should just be myself because either people will like it or they won't course, like it. And of course. I'm not interested in the people that don't like it, so it's fine. Just you do what you do. What's yeah. the long term plan? Do you think it's always going to be music, regardless of what happens with this? Yeah, I, I'm a songwriter as well, so Good. that's like my main background. Mm -hmm. So I always want to write songs because that's like my therapy. Yeah. That's something that I need to do. So yeah, yeah I'll always write songs. Maybe not always sing, but yeah. I love it and it's... But it'll always be the music business for Definitely. you. Definitely. And the yeah. thing is, Will, about it, love, if you can write songs, that's the key to longevity. Yeah. It's also the I key to earning so. an awful lot more money than you <laughs> yeah. were singing them as well. <laughs> so that's quite good too. Listen, give my love to your mum, to I the will. whole family. We wish you all the best. We're right Thank behind you. you. Just Thanks. enjoy. I enjoy. Will. Now you've got the six chair yeah. malarkey out of the road. You can actually start <laughs> enjoying it. Lovely to see you. You too. And good luck with everything you do. Thank you. If you'd like to see even more great guests, then click here. There are plenty more fantastic interviews to come, so make sure that you subscribe.